Hi there. I haven't seen you around before. Of course, they don't give us Sith officers from the military base much time off. I'm off duty right now, so I'm not in uniform. My name is Sana, junior officer first class with the Sith Occupation Force. I'm actually a little surprised you're talking to me at all. Most of the people here on Taris can't stand us Sith. They can make this job pretty lonely. Say the sympathetic best friend act. I'm not buying it. But I don't want to fill out a bunch of paperwork on my day off, so let's just pretend this conversation never happened. Now move along! Back again? Didn't I make myself clear enough? The senior Sith officers don't like us fraternizing with the locals. Besides, I don't need you lecturing me for my career choice. Uh, it's okay. I might have overreacted a bit. But can you blame me? Everywhere I look, I see one of you Teresians glaring at me with hate in your eyes. You're an off-worlder. <laughs> I figured you'd be even more angry being stuck on a foreign planet and all. You're right! It's like everyone on this backwater planet is in a permanent bad mood. Don't they know we have to make the best of things? Exactly, it's all about attitude. I didn't ask to be assigned to this backwater planet, but I try to make the best of it. It's pretty easy to get depressed on an assignment like this, but we do what we can to keep our spirits up. That's true. It's nice to meet someone who understands what I'm going through. It's good to talk about this stuff. It gets pretty lonely up at the military base. I have to get going soon. I've got a ship to the military base, but some of us junior Sith officers are having a party tonight to blow off some steam. I'd really like to see you again. Why don't you drop by the party? I'll show you where it is on your map. Don't be late. We're starting right after our ship's end. Most of us won't even be going back to the base to lock up our uniforms. I look forward to seeing you there. I saw you getting a Pazak lesson from that old fossil Garou. Learning the rules of Pazak is easy, but actually playing the game is a much greater challenge. Normally I wouldn't bother with a novice like you, but since Gerud was banned for hustling cards, I haven't been able to find a good game around here. Do you wish to play a hand? My name is Niklos. I'm the unofficial champion of the Pazak circuit here on Taurus. If you don't mind losing your wager, we could play a few hands. If you ever wish to test yourself against the best Pazak player on Taurus, you know where to find me. What? Why are you speaking to me? Can't you tell from my clothing that I'm of the nobility? Get away from me. I can't be seen talking with a common rabble. You wouldn't be proper for a man of my standing. What? 
Why are you speaking to me? Get away! Nice outfit. I've seen outcasts in the Undercity who dress better than you. Oh, there's too many people in this cantina since they added the music room in the back. They come here to relax, not to fight with crowds. I'm surprised the Sith haven't done anything to try to bring in Devi. After all, everyone knows he's the crime lord who runs this planet. The Sith are hunting for any Republic soldiers who escaped the battle overhead. They even sent a patrol into the Undercity to look for survivors. Look at Nicholas sitting over there with his Pazak deck. I used to play, you know. But I wasn't very good. I finally sold my deck and gave it up. Oh, there's too many people in this cantina since they added the me- You aren't from Terrace, are you? Do yourself a favor and stay away from the Teresian Ale. It packs more kick than most off-worlders can handle. Nice outfit. I've seen outcasts in the Undercity who dress better than you. It's a good thing a few of the Sith come in here to relax when they're off-duty. I should keep them from closing this cantina down. You aren't from Terrace, are you? Do yourself a favor and stay away from the Nice outfit. It's a good thing a few of the Sith come in here to relax. You aren't from Terrace, are you? Do yourself a favor and stay away Have you gone into the music room in the back? Yeah, I don't care much for the band, but those dancing Twi'leks are something else, I'm telling you now. I heard the Sith sent a bunch of patrols to the Undercity. They probably went to loot the crash sites of those Republic escape pods that went down there. Yeah, that lower city is nothing but a slum. If the Sith want to win us Terizians over, they should clean the gangs out of there. You like Pazak? I used to watch it all the time when Gelrug was playing here. He had some great matches against Niklos, until they banned him for cheating. Have you gone into the music room in the back? Yeah, I don't care much for the band. Everyone's worried the Sith will come in here and shut this place down. Can you imagine how dull it would be if we didn't have any music on Terrace? <sighs> Who dresses you? Look like you crawled up here from the lower city. Oh <laughs> well, I guess we can't all have style. Isn't this band great? They can't leave Terrace because of the Sith quarantine, so they've been playing here every night. Talk about a good break for us. <sighs> I don't know what the guys in here find so attractive about those Twi'leks. Look at them. They're dressed like little dirty space wenches. Everyone's worried the Sith will come in here and shut this place down. Can you imagine how dull- You know, it's bad enough the Sith conquered this planet. But do they have to come in here, relax, and rub their presence on our faces? You know, that quarantine must be tough when you off-world are stuck here. You should try and make the best of it and order yourself some Teresian ale. It'll take away some of the sting. I wish the off-duty Sith would stop coming in here for drinks. I mean, scouring the Undercity looking for the Republic escape pods and they leak of the sewers. You know, it's bad enough the Sith conquered this planet. But do they have to come in here, relax, and rub their presence on our faces? I can't believe we couldn't get arena tickets for this match! Now we'll have to watch the duel on the view screen! Who cares? It's Duncan and Gurlon fighting! It's not like we're gonna miss anything good! Shh! They're about to start, so quit complaining and just watch the view screen! Ladies and gentlemen, I draw your attention to the dueling ring! Here, two combatants will battle for your viewing and gambling enjoyment! Now. I hope all your bets are down because we're ready to roll! In this corner I give you Gurlon Twofinger! And over here, looking to climb the ranks yet again, is the ever-persistent Deadeye Duncan! Nobody's great surprise, Deadeye is down again. Don't worry, folks, he's just unconscious. As usual, our medics will have him up and about in a bit. Well, that was quick, wasn't it? So I give you the winner, Gerlon Two Fingers. Is there anything more exciting than a woman who's armed and dangerous? Gerlon used to be one of the best in the game. Now he's barely better than old Deadeye Duncan. That Twitch is an animal. You couldn't pay me enough to get into the ring with him. It's good to see Marl still around after all these years. He proves this isn't just a young man's game. I love watching ice in the ring. 
Is there anything more exciting than a woman who's armed and dangerous? Twitch is my favorite. He's wild. Marl's been around forever. I wonder if he ever thinks about retiring. Why doesn't Duncan just give the sport up? He's terrible! I love watching Ice fight. She proves this isn't just a man's game. Twitch is my favorite. He's wild. Tava! Uba Basca Duana Chichopa Muska! Kiyokaku! Hako Chichopa! Kimba Muli Rab Wanaji! Kiska Nichu! Oska! Kiska Nichu! The Hupa Motenya no Gigi Piti! Hako Chichopa! Kimba Muli Wait, I know what you're going to say. I'm so beautiful, I'm so attractive. How can someone who looks so hot with a weapon in her hand be called ice? Well, I've heard it all before. I'm here to take care of business in the dueling ring. Not to have some slack-jawed, goggled-eyed man slobber all over me. So back off. Well, now you know why they call me Ice. If you're looking for a match, go talk to Azure. He's that big hut over there in the corner. Otherwise, just go away. Back again? Didn't you get the message last time? I'm not here to make friends. Talk to the duel organizer if you want a match. Otherwise, leave me alone. Hello there, Offworld. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Marl. I'm one of the duelists here at the cantina. I was wondering when you'd get around to talking to me. No, we've never met. It's just that most people who come here to watch the duels are bored nobles, looking for a little excitement in their drab lives. But you're different. You look like you know a thing or two about combat. I'm guessing you didn't come here to sit on the sidelines and watch a duel. Are you looking for a match? My area of expertise is pretty much limited to the dueling ring and the other combatants here at the cantina. But I'll try to answer any questions you might have. You've come to the right man. I've been dueling here for nearly 20 years, and I remember every duelist who's been through this cantina. Of course, there are only five of us left now. Duncan, Gurlon, Ice, Twitch, and me. Bendak's Starkiller comes in once in a while, but he's retired now. <laughs> 